Welcome back to SNK Pulse, your ultimate source for captivating historical analysis. In today's video, we delve deep into one of the most significant events of the 20th century, World War II. Join us as we explore the question that has intrigued historians for decades, why did Hitler and Nazi Germany ultimately lose the war? Prepare to uncover the pivotal factors that led to their downfall and shaped the course of history. So, buckle up, and let's embark on this captivating journey into the past. Adolf Hitler, 1889-1945, was a German politician and leader of the Nazi Party. He rose to power as Chancellor of Germany in 1933 and later became the dictator, known as the Fuhrer, with complete control over the German government and military. Hitler's policies and actions had a significant impact on world history, particularly during World War II. His aggressive foreign policy, expansionist ambitions, and racial ideology shaped the course of the war and resulted in immense suffering and loss of life. Under Hitler's leadership, Nazi Germany pursued a policy of territorial expansion and sought to establish a racially homogeneous Greater German Reich. This included the annexation of Austria, the occupation of Czechoslovakia, and the invasion of Poland, which triggered the outbreak of World War II in 1939. Hitler's regime implemented a systematic persecution and genocide of various groups, most notably Jews, during the Holocaust. Six million Jews were systematically murdered in what became one of the greatest atrocities in human history. Other targeted groups included Romani people, disabled individuals, political dissidents, and others deemed undesirable by the Nazi regime. As the war progressed, Hitler's leadership became increasingly erratic and his decisions often disregarded military advice, leading to strategic mistakes and setbacks for Germany. Despite initial successes, Germany faced mounting military losses and the combined strength of the Allied forces ultimately overwhelmed the Axis powers. Hitler's leadership and decision-making played a significant role in Germany's defeat. In April 1945, as Allied forces closed in on Berlin, Hitler committed suicide in his bunker. With his death and Germany's unconditional surrender in May 1945, the Nazi regime came to an end, and Hitler's ideology and policies were discredited and condemned internationally. It is important to remember and learn from the history of Hitler and Nazi Germany to prevent the recurrence of such ideologies and atrocities in the future. Why did Hitler lose World War II? Adolf Hitler and Nazi Germany ultimately lost World War II due to a combination of factors, here are some key reasons for their defeat. Allied military strength, the combined military power of the Allies, including the United States, the Soviet Union, the United Kingdom, and other nations, proved to be overwhelming for Germany. The Allies had superior resources, including manpower, industrial capacity, and advanced weaponry, which eventually tipped the scales in their favor. Soviet resistance and Eastern Front, Hitler's decision to invade the Soviet Union in 1941 was a crucial turning point. Despite initial gains, the Soviet Union's vast territory, harsh weather, and the determination of the Soviet people to defend their homeland made it extremely difficult for the German forces to sustain their campaign. The Battle of Stalingrad in 1942-1943 was a major defeat for Germany and marked a significant shift in the momentum of the war. Strategic Errors Hitler made several strategic mistakes that weakened Germany's position. For example, he diverted resources and troops to multiple fronts, stretching the German military thin and diluting their strength. Hitler's insistence on maintaining control over military operations and his poor decision-making undermined the effectiveness of his generals. Additionally, Hitler's racial ideology, 
which led to the persecution and extermination of millions of people, diverted valuable resources away from the war effort. Allied Air Superiority The Allies achieved air superiority over Germany, which played a crucial role in their victory. The Allied bombing campaign targeted German industrial infrastructure, transportation networks, and cities, causing significant damage and disrupting German production capabilities. The strategic bombing campaign, combined with the effective use of tactical air support during ground operations, weakened German defenses and hindered their ability to mount an effective response. Mobilization of the Allies The Allies effectively mobilized their resources, economies, and populations for total war. They implemented effective strategies for production, logistics, and coordination between different nations, allowing them to outproduce and outlast Germany. The United States, in particular, provided significant material support to the Allies through the Lend-Lease program, which greatly contributed to their overall war effort. Allied Invasion of Western Europe The D-Day invasion on June 6, 1944, marked the beginning of the end for Nazi Germany. The successful landing in Normandy allowed the Allies to establish a foothold in Western Europe and launch a massive offensive against German forces. This invasion put further strain on German resources and pushed them into a two-front war, forcing them to fight simultaneously on the eastern and western fronts. Hitler's declining health and leadership In the later stages of the war, Hitler's declining physical and mental health significantly affected his decision-making and leadership abilities. He became increasingly isolated and detached from reality, disregarding advice from his generals and pursuing unrealistic strategies. This further weakened the German war effort. It's important to note that the factors mentioned are not exhaustive, and there were numerous other contributing factors to Hitler's defeat in World War II. The war was a complex and multifaceted conflict and the combination of these factors ultimately led to Germany's downfall. And that concludes our insightful exploration of why Adolf Hitler and Nazi Germany faced defeat in World War II. We hope you enjoyed this thought-provoking analysis and gained a deeper understanding of the complex factors that shaped this pivotal moment in history. If you found this video informative, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to SNK Pulse for more captivating content. Share your thoughts and comments down below. Thank you for joining us, and until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the fascinating stories of our world. For more informative content subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow our Facebook page. SNK Pulse